Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, it's, it's getting kind of late. It's 9.30 at night. I slept forever today. I don't know what it is. Oh, it looks like I get a shave. You know, what's weird is with my radiation, my beard and mustache, they grow back kind of strange looking. Okay, the word of today, God's word of the day is Churly, spelled C-H-U-R-L-I-S-H. Now, I only find this word in one verse of scripture. Um, I wonder if Churl, I already found that one. Now I got it twice. Let's see. My bad. Yeah, Churl is found in a couple other places, but Churlish. And I only found it in one verse of scripture, and it's a word, again, we don't use too often. Um, so, let's get the pronunciation from dictionary.com. Churlish. See if there's a male version. Churlish. Churlish. Okay. Let's get that one verse of scripture. And it is found in, uh, 1 Samuel 25, 3. It says, now... The name of the man was Nabal, and the name of his wife, Abigail. And she was a woman of good understanding and of beautiful countenance. But the man was churlish and evil in his doings, and he was the house of Caleb. He was of the house of Caleb. Churlish. So the Easton's Dictionary says, it means a deceiver. The word churlish denotes a man that is coarse and ill-natured, or as the word, word literally means hard. The same Greek word as used by um, LXX here is found in Matthew 25, 24, and there is rendered hard. So let's look at 25, 24. Matthew 25, 24, Jesus is speaking. He says, then... He which had received the one talent came and said, Lord, I knew thee that thou art a hard man, reaping where thou hast not sown, and gathered where thou hast not strong. Okay, excuse me. Um, so, the word hard in, in 24, hard man, means the same as surely. The Easton's Dictionary, or not the Easton's Dictionary, but Dictionary.com has it. Like a churl, boorish or rude. Um, it says of churl, peasant-like, niggardly, or mean. Niggardly meaning uh, small. Uh, like he gave a niggardly tip, a small, meaningless tip. Of like or befitting of churl, boorish or vulgar, having a bad disposition. Surely as valiant as the lion, surely as the bear, difficult to work with. Someone that's difficult to work with. Okay, that's surely. That's God's word of the day. Sister Sunshine is doing a great job. Check out her people of the Bible. I really enjoy watching hers and look forward so much to the next one. Take care. Love you guys. Bye bye.